people. I've collected the bits of four Chilean dingle coaches over the year, over the years. Two from Borden and Mona and two from Callan and County Kilkenny. The two in Callan and County Kilkenny were in a, in a builder's yard, and he was a land reclamation uh, contractor in the 1940s. And in the 1950s, the, the carriages were sold off for menace. So he jacked them up and put iron rims under the under the carriages or iron wheels and pulled them home behind his tractor. And I happened to give his daughters a lift one day going to from Dungarvan to Limerick and I started talking trains to them and they said they've got trams in the back garden. So I checked it out and I found a Dublin tram, a Wolverhampton trolley bus and two trolley and dingle coaches and a whole heap of other two foot gauge stuff. So but between Barter and one, the other, one thing and the other, I got the carriages off them. And they're still here in Drummond to this day. So it was about time we started to restore them. And uh, a few of us got together and uh, we have the uh, chassis and bogies and all the bits and pieces of the carriage put onto a, a, a lorry last November and uh, before Brexit came in and off to Cumbria with them. But we had the pandemic here started at the time, but we still got it out and away. And... Uh, Alex, they're in Alex Sharp House's company called John Fowler and Company, and he has the bogies taken apart. He has uh, we have three bogies, and we need a fourth one for a second carriage, two in each carriage, and he's rebuilding a fourth bogey that, when we ever go to restore our second trolley and dingle coach, we have wheels and brakes and everything for it. And in the bottom shed was the third bogey, which was I we found in Bordemona many years ago inside two LMS NCC wagons. And that was down in the workshop for the last 20 years. And the other night we pulled it out. So all three bogies are together for the first time in years and years and years. is a bogey coach has two has two bogies a six wheel coach has six wheels and they're kind of solid underneath the, the, the carriage but um, the uh, the bogey coach will go around corners better and it's easier riding while a four wheel coach or a six wheel coach is not as smooth as a bogey coach and you can fit more people in a bogey coach than you can in a four wheel coach when the original uh, when the Trillian Dingle lying close to passengers in 39 the stock was split between the west clare section of the gsr and the cabin and leitrim section of the gsr and some of them came here to drum it and the ones i found were, were came from clare from ennis and uh but they still the trillion ding carriages still ran here so it'll be recreating the past because uh, it's very hard to, to once things are gone to bring them back well the trillion dingle carriage is got a steel chassis on the top of it's made of wood. This carriage is all steel, and uh, it's um, but your verandas in either end. While the car the trolley and dingle carriages were solid, the, the solid ends, and you got into the carriage through the door. This one you get onto the veranda and then into the carriage, which is different. Well, it it just looks the period. They were built in the eighteen nineties, so uh, in Bristol, and uh, this this one had been all over Ireland on the two few. Uh, we, They've been to uh, Tralee, they've been to Clare, they've been to Callan, and I've had them in from Cal from Care. I brought them from Callan to Care, and from Care to here, Care in County Tipperary, and uh, that's over thirty years ago. So uh, it's something else to see the th same thing come back again.